we have written a national song for England. A sort of English backlash song, you know. <laughs> Go home, Scott sort of song. Ireland, get out of Liverpool. <laughs> Down with Welsh power. We, we, we don't have black power, we have white power, but that's a detergent. <laughs> we hope that all true-born English men and women in our audience will join in the chorus, and if you don't have the good fortune to be true-born, or English, or a man, or a woman, then I hope you will join in as a mark of ordinary, decent respect. <laughs> Always remember, if it hadn't been for the English, you'd all be Spanish. <laughs> this, this is a song, a song calculated, no, calculated to offend practically everybody, this song. The, the English, English, the English, the English are best. I wouldn't give tuppence for all the rest. Typical English understatement. The rottenest bits of those islands are ours. We've left in the hands of three unfriendly powers. Examine the Irishman, Welshman, or Scot. You'll find he's a stinker as likely as not. Okay, as a broad brick, we lift the knick. The Scotsman is mean, as we're all well aware, and bony and blotchy and covered with hair. He eats salted porridge, he works all the day, and he hasn't got bishops to show him the way. <laughs> the English, the English, the English are best. I wouldn't give tuppence for all the rest. Or hit me on mother with a shillelagh. The Irish, but now our contempt is beneath. He sleeps in his boots and he lies in his teeth. He blows up policemen, or so I have heard, and blames it on Cromwell and William the Third. The English are noble, the English are nice, and worth any other at double the price. Oh, you do some Welsh. Ah, vote for Lloyd George, Yakida. The Welshman's dishonest, he cheats when he can. And little and dark, more like monkey than man. He works underground with a lamp in his hat, and he sings far too loud, far too often, and flat. And crossing the channel, one cannot say much for the French or the Spanish, or the Danish, the Dutch, or the Germans are German, the Russians are red, and the Greeks and Italians eat garlic in bed. The English are borrowed, the English are good, and clever and modest and misunderstood. Not forgetting, Not forgetting, in case we've omitted a few, Australians, Australians, Asians, and Africans too. Americans ditto all over the place, regardless of colour, religion, or race. The, the English, English, the English, the English are best. I wouldn't give tuppence for all the rest. It's not that you're wicked or naturally bad. It's knowing you're foreign that's driving you mad. <laughs> All the English are all that a nation should be, and the finale of the English is Donald Michael. Donald Michael.